In this video we're going to take a look at Nokia's Creative Studio. This is a free application, it's exclusive to the Nokia Lumia devices and essentially what it does is takes images and applies effects to them. Now this can be done live with the camera, you can see these live styles and these face warps. You can see you can also select from an album and this is actually easier for this uh, video demo. You can select your save pictures or from your camera roll. So let's just dive into camera roll here. Go and have a look at some of the older photos here. Here's a good one of uh, London London Bridge or Tower Bridge that I took in London. You can see here you can apply the different effects. So let's just choose one of these, say Freaky here. And you can see you get the effect applied live. And one of the nice things is you press this button at the bottom. You can see a before and after effect. You can move this around. Once you decide you want it, you go, yep, that's fine. And then press the Save button. It'll then apply it to the full image and that will then be saved to your Save Images album. just takes a few seconds because obviously it's working on the full resolution image. Once that's done you can opt to share it via Facebook, Flickr or Twitter. So we'll just go and have a look at some of the other options available here. So let's just go choose a different image this time. You can see some ones I took live at MWC there. Let's choose that one this time. You can see the different effects there. They're basically tweaking the light. Then there's some artistic ones at the bottom here, watercolour, uh, carbon and sketch. There's also adjustments. So what you do here is change some specific values. So for example, for exposure, that will obviously change the exposure. You can see that's changing the exposure. Again, you can have a before or after effect. So you can see exactly what involved in doing that. You can see there's also a cropping tool here. So if you just want a specific bit of the image, it's very easy to crop it down. That's nicely done. And then, of course, there's Rotate Contrast, already having the effect that you might expect. One of the interesting things is you can apply effects and then, of course, apply another one. If you uh, do it on the save image, on the live images, uh, you can actually apply an effect after uh, capturing it. There's also this panorama mode. It's obviously difficult to demonstrate here. But essentially what you do is you start taking the picture move it round to the next one, there we go, we'll just end it there and you can see it stitches the image together obviously that's going to work best when you're outside in a landscape situation but I've had a couple of experiments with this, it seems to work pretty well so there we go, there's a quick run through uh, Nokia's Creative Studio, it's a free download from the Windows Phone Marketplace and it's a great way of getting a bit more out of the camera on your phone